Welcome back to my Pokemon X random. It's not a randomizer. Welcome back to my Pokemon X Nuzlocke. Today we're going to be finding out the secrets of Mega Evolution. All right, it looks like you guys have voted, and you can you have said that I can catch a second Pokemon in the next available route. So thank you for that. Thank you for being so nice, so kind. As you can probably hear, my voice is a little bit better than it was last week, thankfully, because <laughs> my voice last week was it was rough. It was rough. Let's be, let's be real. Alright, let's go find out. What the heck is Mega Evolution? Waiting at the top of the tower, okay. Uh, okay, here. Ooh, here we go, cutscene. Maybe not. Maybe they're just moving the camera. Oh, no, cutscene! Alright. I really love this place. When I'm here with my Pokemon looking at the way up in sky above and my wand disappear and I feel like I can do anything. Ba 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 ba! Mega ring for me. Mega ring on his left wrist. Alright, that was a huge ring by the way. Isn't it more of like a mega bracelet? <laughs> Not a mega ring? But I suppose mega bracelet isn't... It doesn't roll off the tongue like mega ring does. Sure, they both have Lucario night. Alright, let's get into the most broken thing in Pokemon history, is Mega Evolution. I feel like Mega Evolved Pokemon can beat Gigantamax Pokemon. I could be wrong, but that's my personal opinion. I think they are much, much stronger in the Mega Evolved state than Gigantamax. I think. I mean, it would make sense. Like, this one Pokemon is specifically Mega Evolved to be better. Whereas, like, any Pokemon can... Gigantamax and get the benefits. Sword Dance, Bone Rush, Metal Sound, Power Up Punch. I think I got Sword Dance here. I just know what to do. I'm like whoosh, using like a dang Power Ranger. Pretty cool. Mega Glove. Oh, I want to make a glove. I don't want to make a ring. Make a glove sound so much cooler. Yep, sword stand, stuff on my attack. Gosh, sharply. Um, he's attack rose, so I assume my power punch will kill him. Okay, I'm glad that I did that. Holy cow. Holy cow, that was close. What an explosive battle, I can tell you, but admittedly, Kyrie didn't help back. With strong bonds like that, you shouldn't have any trouble drinking your Pokemon's Mega Evolution. Okie dokie. Yeah, I'll take him with me. Uh, who should we send back? I feel like we should send back Chuck. We don't need two fire types. It's Sorry, we don't need two fire types. Uh, Lucario's nickname is gonna be... Yeah, Punchy Punch. Done. Isn't he glad to have come along with me? <laughs> okay, we're going to the right. Uh-oh. Oh, no. Oh, surf. Alright, yeah, I'm fine with that. Thanks. Alright, bye. 12. Route 12, which means we can get two Pokemon in here because you guys voted on it. So, how many Pokeballs do I actually have? Um, like, can I catch a Pokemon here? I've got one Great Ball. One Heal Ball. I maybe should go get some more Pokeballs. I'll be right back. Alrighty. Got some Ultra Balls, so let's catch a Pokemon. Let's catch a good Pokemon, please. Please, something good, please. I don't- like, what did I do to deserve this? Why do they keep giving me Pokemon like this? Yeah, that'll do. Very simple. <laughs> also, I can switch out him for Love Disc. I think just a strict upgrade. <clears throat> I 
Sure, I'll be right back. I'll be, I'll be right back. Uh, hello, you said something about a Lapras. I, sure. Sure. I will take a Lapras. Uh, look, I'm gonna say that that's my second Pokemon for this route, even though it was given to me. I'm gonna say it's my second because it feels a little cheap to get a Lapras and something else. This Lapras is just so cool. It's so cool. Oh, they give you a Lapras just in case, like... Because they just gave me Surf. So they give you a Lapras so you can teach the Lapras Surf so you can continue. Okay. I like this house design. Like with a second story up here. It's pretty cool. Shiny stone. Alright, I'll take it. None of my Pokemon evolved with the shiny stone, but sure. I can't have battles while I'm on this, can I? I'm dumb. <laughs> I'm, so, I'm so dumb. <laughs> oh, Nito, I'm here. Okay. Yeah, it's fine. I have a mega I have a mega evolved Pokemon. I'm fine. Hmm, okay. That's good to know. There's an incense dude there. That'll boost the power of my Pokemon's moves. Oh look, is that the champion? Hello then. Holy cow, I've gotten fly, I've gotten surf, I've gotten so many TMs just in this just by walking around. People are just like, hey. You're a, you're a trainer. Here's a TM. <laughs> the next time we meet is literally at the Pokemon League. Is this a town? Where's the Pokemon Center? Sure. What was the type of special attack stat? Uh, Confide. Yeah. Nito, I got it. Ah, here we go. Um, so what I'm gonna do is actually just lead with Lucario. Mega Evolved. I like maybe Mega Evolution Pokemon literally just can't compare. Like he's just it's so strong. That's the exit. I don't want to go that way. Where is the coin? That's not the coin, but I'll take that. Sky plate. Okay. Weird that Arceus's plates are here. That's a little weird. Uh oh. Sorry I'm late. Show me Mega Evolution. Of course. Blah 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 blah. Oh, she doesn't know how to use Mega Evolution. Ooh, okay. I have a clear advantage. Oh. Yeah, I have a clear advantage. She's got three Pokemon. It's. It's. Clear advantage, like there's no way I'm gonna lose this. She's got three Pokemon. Hit him. No, I meant him, not you. I feel like I just beat this, right? Yeah. It doesn't matter that I'm it doesn't matter that I'm on one. I'm faster than the Meowstic and I can kill it. So I just gotta switch before next Pokemon comes in. Yeah, I can- I can body slam this. Although, like... Uh, Protean... <clears throat> I didn't know it had water absorb, I'm actually smarter than I thought. <laughs> it is good that Lapas has Perish Song as well. So we should be, like... Good to kill any Mega Evolved Pokemon during the Pokemon League. Should be very good. Because I'm pretty sure in the Pokemon League, every final Pokemon they have, Mega Evolves. So Lapras would be fantastic for that, because I can just Perish Song, and then just switch out to something else for the next two turns.
Ugh, critical hit. Okay. Not the good. Paris counts on three. We need to keep note of that. Let's go Surf. So I'm pretty sure Lapras can take out a hit. Yep. It dies to a crit next turn, so I'm going to switch. Paris count fell to two. Um, let's switch, just in case. I don't want Lapras to die. I need it. It's probably going to use Slash again, so Big Chopper can take it. Or a Dark-type move, which it can take anyway. I think it's... I think Morvile's Steel and Dark. Intimidate as well. It's fantastic. Apple's going to use Bite. Does not matter. Press count fell to one. Um, and let's just use Fake Tears. Quick attack. Totally fine. You're, you're minus one attack anyway. You're going to do nothing. Press count fell to zero. Fantastic. All right. Lapras is going to carry us through the game. <laughs> Carries through the Pokemon League, for sure. You just don't have a Mega Evolve Pokemon. That's it. Even though I use my Mega Evolve Pokemon once. <laughs> now I've got to go heal. Don't tell me to do good in the gym battle. I've got to go heal my Pokemon now. Do good in the gym battle with all of your weak Pokemon. I feel like Game Freak really liked this function. Some intern was like, you know what we should do? We should make an entire gym with ropes. How about that? And everyone else was like, Game Freak was like, that's a great idea. Let's do it. So they made an entire gym out of it. And they made it unnecessarily long. I think this is like... This is up there for the longest gym ever in Pokemon. Alright, we're finally here. Hello, old dude. How do you get up here every day? Alrighty. So, let's leave with Pyromaniac because fire type. Uh, we do need to keep in mind we have Lapras. And we also do have a Mega Evolution Pokemon that we can use as well. But we're going to keep in mind Lapras for their final Pokemon. Because he can just use Perish Song. And then we can just switch out after two turns. And we've got the, we've got the game. Oh, so you made it up here. I'm the gym leader. Ramos is the name. This is the wrong accent, but just please ignore it. So what do you think, you whippersnapper? Did you enjoy the garden playground I made with all these sturdy plants of mine? His strength is a sign of his strength in as a gardener as a gym leader. You sure you're up to facing all that? Yeah, yeah, I'm pretty sure I'm up to it. Thanks, Ramos. Jump off. Flying grass, I want to say. So, a good old flame charge should uh, fix this right up. Yikes. Okay. Guess we're switching soon. We do have more speed, so we're going to be faster than Jump Bluff. After this next hit... Okay, we're faster now. So, we should have the kill on the next, on the next hit. Okay, Leech Seed is fine, because we're probably going to switch out into Lapras eventually anyway. But we do need to keep Leech Seed in mind. We are at half health as well. So Jump Bluff dies in this next hit. I don't think we get... I don't think Leech Seed happens. Ah, oh, man. That's annoying. Okay, will... Will Breakson survive? I don't think it'll survive with another Leech Seed hit. I don't think I'm going to survive the Acrobatics and the Leech Seed, so I think I'm going to switch. So I assume it's going to use Acrobatics again, because that's the only move I know of. Let's go into Big Chomper. I assume Acrobatics is a physical type move, so if you switch into Big Chomper, he can use Intimidate and then lower its attack. Plus, I think he's also got Protect, so we can try and protect against Acrobatics. Let's see. Oh, perfect, perfect. I did absolutely nothing. We do have Protect, but I think I'm just going to go for Bite. I'm going to try and kill it first. Leech Seed is fine. Like, it's not super effective against my Pokemon, so... It it's totally fine. Not as much damage as I was thinking about that. That's kind of annoying, actually. Did heal basically all the bite damage I just did. Let's do fake tears. Acrobatics is going to do like 8 damage to us. That was a little bit more than 8 damage, because it was a crit. Fake tears to lower its special defense by 2 stages, which will allow whatever Pokemon to switch into an easier time. He uses acrobatics, most likely. 
So I need to switch into Lapras so he can tank the hit and use Ice Beam on his next turn. If I switch into Lucario, he's probably just going to die. And I don't want that to happen because I need Lucario. He's a Mega Evolved Pokemon. <clears throat> Acrobatics, that's great. We were expecting that. So I'm not sure if it's faster. I'm going to assume Jump Off is faster, so let's use Ice Beam. Grass Knot. Ooh. That's a lot of damage. But Ice Beam kills, it's, it's four times effective. Okay. Okay. I need to look up the stats, man. I need to know. I, I don't know if Lapras is going to survive this, so I need to look up the showdown. Just so I can be sure. Does Ice Beam kill here? Ice Beam definitely kills Weeping Bell in one shot. Um, we are faster. So I would assume we can kill here. I'll just go for it. Ice Beam. <laughs> Easy peasy. Alright, that's Weeping Belt down. We've only got Go Goat to go. Go Goat to go, yeah. I'm going to assume Lapras is not faster than the Go Goat. Level 34 Go Goat. Alright. Okay, I think we just go for Perish Song. Because if I can get off Perish Song and survive the hit from Go Goat. And I can switch into a Pokemon, and then we just win in three turns. Takedown should be fine. We've got enough health. Oh, easy! Perisom will set the turn limit to three, so no matter what, they lose. So let's switch into something else. Uh, he's going to probably use Takedown again. Or he, can he sees a kill with anything, so I'll switch into Lucario. Just so we can tank a hit. This is, this is it. This is the game. That was easier than expected. I mean, it is... Grass is one of the basic types, so it's going to be pretty easy to beat. Perish count fell to two. Let's Mega Evolve and then Power Up Punch. Let's try and kill the Go-Go in two turns. But basically, all we need to do is just survive for two turns and then we just win. Bulldoze. Do we survive that? Easy. Okay, but we do need to switch again. Perish count fell to one, which means we switch into anything. Bulldoze is a ground type move, right? Bulldoze is a ground type move. Takedown is a physical, a normal type move. So basically, my Drift Loom is the perfect counter. <laughs> I mean, why not, right? I only know of two of his moves, so. We just need to survive one hit. Bulldoze. Doesn't affect because I'm flying. Perish count fell to zero. Perfect. We played that game like an absolute fiddle. We're masters. <laughs> Amazing. Yeah, I, I, this is great. Leader Ramos, easy. You can't take things too quickly when it comes to forming a friendship with your Pokemon. Sprout. Thanks, buddy. You believe in your Pokemon, they believe in you too. Mighty Oaks from Acorns grow. Go then, you earned it. Use your own plant badge, Sprout. Hell yeah. That's mad. If you've got yourself a plant badge, then you can use the HM Fly. Even when not battling, it's a real boon. Pokemon up to level 60 will listen to you. Easy as falling off a log. Even if you got it from a trade. Here you have this too. Might as well make hay while the sun shines, I reckon. Grass Knot. Fantastic. Alright, thank you so much for watching. I'm not going to give you a question today or this week. I'm going to save that till next week. But make sure to check out the poll that comes out today as well. Because I want to try and make... Uh, another meme video and I want you guys to decide which one or which game I should play. So thank you so much for watching. I'll see you in the next one.